All right, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the weekly update call on all platforms. We are mostly going to speak about Gift of Legacy today. Uh, as you all know, there were very important announcements made about the removal of the auto join on the higher boards, which is very good news for us. Uh, it's not going to have an effect on all our boards, but we'll, we'll get to that shortly. They also announced that the removal of profiles that you don't log in will be extended soon uh, to 90 days uh, for the people that don't get to their profiles as often as they're supposed to. I still can't understand why we can't get to them. And I frequently fight with a few people assisting me checking profiles. Why must I get a seven-day warning mail? Log in every 14 days. I know it's difficult for some people. You get busy and things happen, but... Uh, how are you going to know what's going on on your board if you don't go check there once in a while? All right, quickly the plan forward, and we're going to work this board by board. Uh, we do have a core, a core group, which make a lot of uh, decisions and discuss a lot of plans and strategies that we can follow. Um, that will carry on as normal, but we may once in a while pull in some other people with profiles that is sitting on a various amount of on a lot of boards the basic thing that you must understand and Liana made this very clearly for us or clear for us in a group that we opened or that we had open called uh, GL boards to be worked on or well, I think that's a new group that I made uh, I am going to to open this group now for the people we will delete all the messages we discussed there and then we can start with receiving board photos but the most important thing, and Yana said it very, very clearly, uh, we all know what to do, but she said it in very direct words. There's three ways to work on a board. First one is to bring in new people. And don't come with this negative story of I can't prove anything. There's enough proof of photos in the groups, in the legend group where boards move fast and continuously. So don't tell me you can't prove to somebody that Gift of Legacy is working. It's working. It went by very slow in the last few months, but it's now going to pick up speed again. So that's a one way to get people in. That's an optimum. Get somebody new in. Second option is to sponsor somebody in. But there's also a few challenges there. You need to make sure this person is educated, that he understands gifting, that he understands Gift of Legacy, that he's got his gifting platforms in place. Wise, PayPal, crypto wallets, all those things. And then the third option is to take yourself another position on a board. Uh, if everybody works on their own board, all be good. You're going to take forever because then there's going to be one gifter on. We will have to work together as a group. Now, Christina made this big post about contributing to... Another platform for GGM, it's working. She sorted the profile out for them. We transferred, I think, Fusina just confirmed for me, $161 yesterday to them. And then we'll do another one on Monday. Uh, myself will put $200 in for them. For the people that is on the list that volunteered as servant leaders, who currently don't have $10 to contribute. So I'll cover 20 of them. Uh, that will also be done on Monday or Tuesday early, depending on my withdrawals. Um, so those people that that volunteered there's now work for you to do that's the people that is basically that was also a test to see who's active in the groups we've got more than what is the amount now 900 people uh, green vehicles 890 people five more left because they realize I'm going to start pointing people soon for not contributing to the community in any which way so out of 890 people, only 100 is actually active. But then we work with those 100. We will work with them. Uh, we will have a meeting in the next few days between uh, our core five. We, we will discuss which boards and which side we're going to start working on. There's also various options. There's many, many options available there. The one option is that we push the eagles a little bit because we're still very uh, very few on the eagles we do have the advantage that we're sitting there in boards between Bobby and myself on legend position where we then can easily get people on board 
and uh, move the legend through to the next bronze board. Very important there. Uh, I did commit to sponsor for everybody on the list that contribute, physically contribute to the contributions to, to GGM, two profiles, either on the Eagles or somewhere else. You will get a link and you will then be, uh, or I will give the legend on that one. So that will also be 1250. The legend will sponsor in 8750 and I will then give the legend on the perpetual board. It's not going to be a fast process. It's a huge amount of boards, but we'll, we will take them one by one. On this uh, submarine, we've got two types of boards currently. Remember, boards is not a profile. A board is a board where there's a lot of profiles on. We've got the first boards that we got open that we will then, as I request photos, go through the photos and decide which ones we're going to work on. And then we've got the perpetual boards where there's version 2s. We will help the version 2s to get their second one in if they don't have two yet. So that by the time they in legend that they can go over then to the silver board. The idea is to get as many as possible through to silver in the shortest available time. And once you're on silver, Bobby mentioned it very clearly, or we explained it very clearly. The moment you land on silver, go peak so long. Don't join, just go peak the gold board so that we know what we're working towards. And as you move up on the silver, then uh, make ready. Your first four gifts on silver goes to the, the gold board. As we move the gold boards, obviously, then we'll start filling the, the platinum. Also remember, eagles and submarine flow to the same, same platinums. We've got other lineages all in between. Let's just go back then to the lineages where we're not going to sponsor people in on at 12.50 or 87.50. Art style will carry on as normal where Benice will manage those profiles. And uh, New Beginnings will also go on as normal where she will manage the people going on board there. Uh, there is a New Beginnings Canelian profile where she already started sponsoring people in. Uh, she will manage uh, those lineages uh, and get the people on board that's there. The people that I added uh, as sponsored profiles on New Beginnings, only a few of us took additional profiles of our own $100. If you're on your second or third profile there and you didn't contribute anything yet, start contributing so that you can get more profiles. Otherwise, you will be bypassed. Somebody asked me in the week, why do they only have two profiles and somebody is up to four already? Said that person had, uh, transferred $200 for the two additional profiles. This person only contributed $20 so far, so he's got two profiles. How can you expect a free profile every few weeks if you don't put something in? The New Beginnings doesn't run for free. The legends must still be gifted. So on the dream projects, we'll work on, on Eagles, we'll work on all the vehicles. Uh, I am going to ask you to post photos. There's going to be a huge amount of photos. We understand that. And then as we start working on a board, we will make a separate chat group for that board and then delete the photo in the main group. The board groups groups that's already open, I, will, I started working through them in the week from the bottom upwards. There's some that's very close to finishing. There's some, uh, I think Melanie is on one where I am going to give the legend on the perpetual board. I think that's the only one currently that's ready to close. We'll go through the track boards. When you post a photo, just mention if it's track, cruise, caravan, eagles, submarine, or DCP. DCP boards are looking very bad, but we will work through them. We've got a lot of our people on there on both those lineages, A and B. Helene has uh, got a huge downline, but a lot of people also disappeared, so we'll go through the boards. If we have a presence on a board, we will work on the board. Speak to the legend, and we will see what we can do there. Uh, on spreadsheet A, it's mostly people from my side of the lineage. We will go through them and see what we can do to get those boards moving. Uh, Lana's asking, must the photo be only of one? No profile photos, just a board photo. I just want to see a board photo. I want to see the members on the board. 
without the info blocks. I will from there, if more photos is requ required of info blocks, I will request them in the group for that specific board. So that's a way that we're going to work. Again, I'm going to go through what is needed to work on a board. You need new people. You need somebody to sponsor in or you take yourself a position. This is not cloning. It's just an extra position you take. Uh, on my side, I did start speaking with Pegasus again. They will take 56 positions on whichever boards we place them at $12.50. And then if they're happy that the auto join or the removal of the auto join if the desired effect, they will then start putting in more people. So whatever they've got in currently, I didn't check recently. I uh, can't remember. I think there's 60 some odd. We'll add 56 also on the board. So with, on my side, I will then get them to register and whoever contributed on the list to GGM will also get two sponsored profiles on whichever board I place you. Um, it's going to be my choice where I place you. It may be on any of the vehicles. It will be on the board where it's needed most at that stage. Obviously, not only my own decision. That will be a decision that will be taken with whoever at that stage uh, is discussing the board, either Bobby and myself or Andrew and myself or Leana and myself or the people on the board and myself. Uh, Bobby will also contact people if he works on a board. My input there is not needed. Bobby knows how to operate boards. He's an expert on that. So if he start communicating with you to get a board going or to close a board, follow his guidance. He will guide you through step by step. The same with Andrew. Andrew uh, knows exactly what to do on the boards. Uh, we did start sending photo uh, requests in to get profiles that was deleted for the error messages when we were not sitting on boards reactivated. Uh, Andrew has got a few. Bobby got a lot. I've got a lot. We will get them activated again. And we will then uh, take the funds that's available and start putting them on the perpetual boards. The faster we can fill the perpetual boards, the faster we can take the people through to silver that's not yet on silver. We've got just over 900 people on the perpetual boards, plus the version twos, plus a few that in the recent times also went through to perpetual. Uh, what's important, the moment that you're on a perpetual board and for some other reason you have other funds available from other platforms or from Gift of Legacy, get that profile on the silver. Every board that gets completed moves one to a perpetual bronze board. Every eight bronze board boards that gets finished fills a silver it's not going to fall on the same board but on average it fills a silver board in effect will cause one new profile onto gold every 60 bo 64 perpetual boards on the submarine or 64 boards on other pro uh, profile uh, other lineages that we complete push one through then to platinum that's a, that's a easy numbers there's no magic in the numbers people there's no magic in the numbers it works uh according to what we do at the bottom it's going to be a lot of hard work we've got a huge amount of boards i couldn't determine an exact amount yet um i i made a list of how many boards i am on with profiles that i manage and assist with all the npo profiles uh all the uh, auxilio profiles all the kana foundation uh, infinity stock file profiles I'm going to take them over as sponsor profiles there's about 6 or 7 of the people that I know they will take ownership of their profiles but the rest is, is going to become sponsor profiles also the changing of details I've tested a few now uh, profiles that were given to us for sponsor profiles you send in a mail please change the phone number and they change the phone number so at least your phone number uh, is reachable for the people that decided not to carry on with their profiles. A few people were clever enough to give it over for us for sponsor profiles. So those things we will do step by step. Uh, it doesn't mean that every time you send support an email to change a phone number or to change some details or make a profile actor that you must send me a message. I can't handle that amount of messages. Do your bit for the survival and the the future of Gift of Legacy.
Everybody will have to work together. Like I said, now it looks like we're only 100 people that wants to work together. Then so be it. Those 100 people will work. Start getting new people in. Start taking another position for yourself once in a while. And wherever we can assist, we will put people in. If you want to sponsor in, we, we still do have a few people on the sponsor list left, but not many. There's not many individuals there. So if you've got people that wants to be sponsored in, make sure they're trained so we can sponsor them in. Uh, that's my update on Gift of Legacy. Anybody that wants to contribute anything else? Morning, Captain. Silence. Yes, who's that? Paula, how are you? Wonderful, thank you. How are you? I'm um, good, best day of my life. <laughs> Mine too. Why? So you mentioned, you mentioned the version 2 profiles. No, I ask you what? a question. Why is it the best day of your life? Oh, because I'm alive. God is good. I'm breathing. I'm on this side of the earth. Grateful. Good. Good. Right. What do you want to ask about version 2s? So you mentioned version 2s, but you did not mention the profiles that were created before version 2. Are, are, they, are those going to be work the same? Yeah, you need to get that profile onto a perpetual board now. Remember, the plan was to use the version 2 money which you receive on the silver board to go reactivate your version 1. But now this ah. it's going to be faster now because your okay. version 2 is going to receive money on the perpetual bronze board. You take the first 400 and go to silver. The, the fifth gift that you receive, you go activate or you place your version one on a board. So that will immediately cause cause more flow on the perpetual boards. And then number five, yeah, that's number five. Number six, you take your committed position because a lot of you people conveniently forgot about your committed position. Number seven is then yours, uh, which you can keep. And number, number eight is taking your version two to the next bronze board. So I'm going to go quickly through it again. When your version 2 profile lands in Legend, first four gifts goes for silver. The number five gift goes to activate your version 1 profile and get it on a board to cause more flow. Your sixth gift goes for your committed position on one of the other vehicles. Number seven is yours, and number eight takes your version 2 to the next bronze board. Got it. Thank you. Sounds good. good. Yeah, no, that's going to work. Remember, every version one that we now place, if I, whatever money I've got available, whatever version one I've got hanging around is going to land on a on a perpetual bronze board. It will be taken through as the money comes in. As you know by now, between Bobby and myself, we sponsored a lot of people in. Our cash flow is not always too good. I had to rely on a select little group of people just to get me through the last month after I went to hospital. Uh, but it is now suddenly picking up again. God sometimes takes you through a little bit of a of a drought just to make sure that you understand the amount of blessings that he every day gives to you. Uh, all the two new platforms that I've been working on now for a few weeks is magically performing very very well uh extremely well we 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 saw the favor of god in the things that we're doing there which will also always flow back to gift of legacy as well that's important to remember very important to remember all right any other questions silence Right, then quickly over to a few of the other things. Uh, the people that's on Berry, we are sorting out the issues that we experienced there. I am not very much uh, excited about the return on investment on Berry. I'm not very much excited about the way that our groups has been treated. Uh, we are sorting it out. It is more or less a long-term thing. You only double your money once every 35 days, roughly. That's not very good for me. Uh, we are on Canelian for the people that's not on Canelian yet. There's a lot of people on here that is on Canelian. It's working very well. If you build your downline, 
with a plan it can work out dusty is not even on my affiliate list because he's too too far down this is my level nine but dusty flows into other profiles which eventually flows into me uh, very encouraging things also happening on Canelian. A lot of people already started taking money out uh, and started specifically new beginnings, started taking profiles. Uh, there's a few that work the strategy that is in a position very soon to also take out more money and uh, use it on other platforms. Doesn't mean you mustn't look after yourself. First, fill your own cup. Make sure that you've got enough food and, and stuff in the house. But Canelian is a, is a very good and solid way to obtain a little bit more income for yourself there's a basic strategy there is a video on it if you can work yourself up to about two and a half thousand contract value you keep for yourself 379 dollars every week which is a reasonable amount in any country's terms bobby what's that number did you work it out yet what's 379 what's exchange right now it was 18 somewhat somewhere in the week Stefano was 18.32 this morning. 18.32. Well done. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's a good amount of money. Let's even work on 17. If it settles a bit, little bit lower, uh, you're looking at, at a huge amount. I'm going to quickly do the numbers here on a spreadsheet. It's 3.79 times 17 gives you 6.4 multiply. Let's work on a month. Uh, 4.33. 27,000 rands. That's a good amount of money in any language. For the people that works in dollars, 379 times 4.33 gives you $1,600 a month. A lot of people started small, but I've got the people who joined shortly after me who followed the strategy. Martin Nietling, I think we started him on something like $20. Uh, he's now in a situation where he can withdraw four times this coming week. Uh, there's people who started on 15 and build it up to 40, withdraw and then reinvest. They're up to $100 already. It escalates. It starts escalating. So just follow the guidance in those specific groups. But remember, the main aim of that is to go assist on our Gift of Legacy boards. Then also, we, uh, we joined another gifting community called Eternal Seed. It's been running for 13 years. It uh, It works. It works on every uh, $25 board, every cycle that you go through after the first one, you keep $175 for yourself. So you can easily keep $75 for yourself there and use the other 100 for our boards. If we do have a legend that sponsors in with $87.50, you can take eight positions with $500. Easy as that. Okay, if you need any more information about the other platforms, send me a message and we'll give you more information and get you on there. Uh, it's, uh, it is working. Uh, just back to Gift of Legacy. Somebody asked me in the last few days, do I really believe that Gift of Legacy got a future? Do you think I will be on this call if I don't believe in the future of Gift of Legacy? Do you think Bobby will be on this call if he doesn't believe in the future of Gift of Legacy? I can call you all out. Miria, Carmen, Paula, Vanessa, anybody. Why will you sit on a call talking about Gift of Legacy if you don't believe in the future of Gift of Legacy? This is not a hope that we're clinging to. This is faith. We are believing that it's going to work. We did all this hard work for 14 months. And now the fruit is going to come through. And uh, for the people that always say we are always on the first boards, I don't have any profiles on the submarine high up. I think my first profile is sitting in position 124 or something. It's all sponsor profiles. Eagles, it's all sponsor profiles. Caravan, all those things, sponsor profiles. That's what we're doing. Yes, eventually our profiles will also filter through and we will also receive abundance. So be it. Just trust the process. Right. I see no more questions. Who wants to ask anything? And then after that, I'm going to give you a chance to talk about anything you want to talk to, except motivational stuff. We leave that for tomorrow evening. I have a question about chameleon. Yes. So I have not visited any sites. I just hear you guys talking about it. So it's just a trading platform, or do I need to bring people in in order for it to for everybody to for it to work? 
You don't need to bring people in for it to work. It works faster if you bring people in, but you can go put a few dollars in there, follow the strategy mm -hmm. according to the videos that I posted where you take out and reinvest, work your contract value up, and eventually get to a point where you can keep every week some money for yourself or from every withdrawal. Mm -hmm. uh, and then, did you watch the videos, Paula? I have not. I have not slowed down enough to visit all these areas. So, yes. And that's why I have not been as active as I usually am in the Telegram. I just got a mm -hmm. lot going on right this second, but I will. Eventually, in about a couple of weeks, I'll slow down enough to go through all of it. But yeah, I will. Send me a message so I can send you a small voice note on to how easy it is to actually just get on board. If you get on board now, even if it's a small amount, you don't need a downline. The downline do assist a lot, tremendously. Okay. Uh, but if you, you don't need a downline, Martin Nietling, his only downline is the people that I loaded below him. One person below him and one below that. So he doesn't. he's only got three people on his downline. But he takes his own money, withdraw every few days and reinvest. And then he started building it up to a reasonable amount. Very easy system. Send me a message so I can send you a voice note and explain how to do it. We need to get you on board now, even if we start with a small amount. Okay. Will do. Thank you. Very okay, good. Stefan, just a question, please. Kobus here. Yes. Um, I've registered a downline in Canelian this morning. Uh, it shows on their account, AJ Potti is the upline. But on my account, it does not display them as a downline. Does it take a few? Does it take a day? Give it till, uh, give it till Monday. It's weekend. Give it till Monday. If it still doesn't show, send the inquiry to support. Okay. Thank you very much. They they fix it very very quickly. It's it's a few minutes and it's fixed. Some people didn't use my link when they registered. I managed to get them back on my downline. You did. You do lose the first. A transactions commission that's not the end of the world except if it's a big amount but uh, they, they can link it back to you if it doesn't show by monday send them a uh inquiry i'll do that thank you very much appreciate it you're welcome anybody else that wants to talk about anything Bobby said I mustn't call him out as a guest speaker every time he's on a call, but he's got such a soothing voice and he always talks so much sense. I'm tempted to do it again. He may never forgive me for this, but so be it. Well, but Bobby, maybe we have hit Christina for a chance to talk. She's always so quiet there in the background, not talking to us. I think she'd love an opportunity, to be honest with you, Stefan. Christina, I, I, I like that support. Oh. Bobby is one of my favorite people. Christina, unmute yourself and tell us about life. What have you been doing this week? I discovered my true why, why I started um, my Gift of Legacy profile or profiles. I discovered my true why why I'm doing all these things and it is really amazing if you actually um, have the if, if you know why because I think most of us do these because we want to generate extra cash flow why do you need the ca extra cash flow you need the extra cash flow because you want to pay the bills you want to pay SARS you want to pay medical bills you want to pay your dog food, your cat food, you want to put fuel in your vehicle, you want to buy your new granddaughter um, full, um, new clothes and nappies and things. And that is what we think is the reason why we want to do these things, to pay all those things. But the real question you should ask yourself is, how would it make you feel if you pay all of those things? So it might be that... You sleep better, you are less stressed, it makes you feel happy. Um, and, and the moment that you realize what your true why is, you would be able to share Gift of Legacy or any other platform with much um, more ease. Because, and, and, and you must also take into consideration what may the other person's why be. 
but if you share your gift of legacy or any of these other platforms out of a feeling of lack or um, yay, yippee, I'm going to earn commission on you if you join or um, you just want to make the sale, then that won't um, probably won't won't work. So I would, if anything, I would encourage everybody to find out what is their true why, what is their real reason for having joined Gift of Legacy or C12 or Berry or or Eternal Seeds, any other platform. What is your true why? So if we've got time, um, people can maybe just think about that. Why do you want more money? What do you want to do with them? What would you want to do with the money when you receive it? And how will that make you feel? That's a very good explanation of why. You see, Bobby, she can actually be a good speaker if she wants to. Stephen, I think we should use her far more often, to be honest with you. Mm. Mm. Definitely. You guys use no, use no. me more than enough with all the things that I that I actually can do. <laughs> no, but you don't speak enough. That's 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 a challenge we've got. We feel that you don't speak enough in public. We need to make you more public. Mm. You play a very important role in this whole engine that we're running. What Bobby said, we're a bus, one of those intercity buses, Greyhound. You're a very important part of that bus. And people yes, need to know is. about you. People don't have any idea what you do behind the scenes. It's scary. It's scary the amount of work Christina puts through every day. Yes. And then she needs to also. <clears throat> Also listen to all my verbal abuse every day. It's <laughs> been a very difficult life. Paula, you want to say something? Christina is our buffer against you, Stefan. So, yes, we love Christina. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now you're using it uh, as, a, as a defense mechanism. That's good to hear. Yes. <laughs> sure. Yeah, that's, that can be so... Right, uh, people, if there's no, no other questions, nobody else that wants to add something, then we're going to close. I'm going to have the recording up in a few minutes. Do remember, we've got a crypto training call with Lisa also Saturdays at half past two. I don't do much there. I just say hello and then hand over to us. He's going to discuss Trust Wallet today, how to set Can up I... and how to operate your Trust Wallet. Yes, Paula? How do I join that session? There's a group called Stefan Zoom Links and Recordings, where all the links are posted. Oh, okay, okay. Festina just added me that to that one this morning. Okay, I'll yeah, look at Fistina, that. You see, Festina is so fast. I want to add you, and then she's already done it. <laughs> she just did a couple hours ago. Okay, thank you. Okay, good. Right. Uh, yeah, she will speak about Trust Wallet. Uh, I did compare costs. Uh, Trust Wallet is, is reasonably inexpensive. Um, there's some others. Vala is is expensive on small amounts. Uh, I've been using Exodus, which is not too bad, except on USDT transfers, but still it works out on about just over a dollar per transaction on on Tron. Uh, yeah, but we, we will, uh, Lisa will discuss uh, Trust Wallet today. He's also busy making other small training videos that we will post all over the place in the next few days. Uh, for you that don't know Lisa, uh, Lisa is from Cape Town. I've met her somewhere last year, I think in March or April. Uh, she's also helping a lot of people to register and to, to understand what every platform is doing and how to operate it. Uh, she helps a lot to set up of your crypto wallets and things. She's a very community-driven so, so uh, don't let us say with 400 messages a day, but if you need help, then uh, you can always send a message. All right, thank you for everybody on here. Recording will be up soon. Have a lovely Saturday afternoon for the people uh, that is available tomorrow night. Uh, motivational call will be at 7. We're not going to have the competition yet this week. I'm, I'm still not ready for, for the co competition about the maps or the countries of the world. We'll do that very soon. Uh, I must actually just psych up the teams again for that. 
Uh, and then we will have a Canadian call on Tuesday. To be honest, I said I must cut down the Zoom calls. It's too much. But suddenly, the amount of viewing hours skyrocketed on YouTube as well with all these extra videos. But we will cut it down to about four big calls and a few smaller ones during the week. All right. Have a good Saturday. Unmute. Say bye. Thanks, everyone. Have a nice day, everybody. Thank you very much. Bye, bye everybody. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. Bye. 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 Bye.